Food parks are the thing these days because they afford the customers so much more in options and choices. We see them in all the major areas in the metropolis, and this week, we visited this one in Timok Avenue called the Yard Street Food Cinema and sat down with one of the owners, Anna Barbara Soriano. Anna and her siblings have been in the food business for some time, operating a chain of farinas, locos empanada, and of course two other branches of the yard. Since I partnered with my siblings to open the first branch of the yard, actually we came about it from our travels. So we came across the food parks in other countries, specifically in Europe and in the U.S., so we decided that maganda siyang concept that we wanted to bring it here in the Philippines so that families and friends can have a venue where they can uh, enjoy good food and unique food and a really good ambience. This one in Timog is their third branch. The two others have different themes, and for this, their third branch, they decided to offer something different. So for our third branch, we made sure that we come up with a concept that people hasn't seen before. And this concept is an outdoor cinema plus food. So it's a good match food plus movies. So, that's the main concept of this third branch. This opened only in November of this year, a family-friendly food park with all the amenities of an outdoor cinema. Office workers come in for a variety of choices, and families with children in tow also love the unique cinema experience. Like, for example, we have a pizza that is fried crust pizza and then we also have ribs uh, that has cheese on it and a lot more other concepts that are really really uh, unique. We handpicked all of the tenants, they really went through strict screening so that we know that all of them can offer something that is worth the money. The open-air food park is around 500 square meters, but the layout allows for as many as 500 diners. It has 25 food stalls, each offering something different, and for those afraid to get soaked, no worries. The owners are soon to install waterproof parachutes, so you can dine outdoors dry and comfortable even in rainy weather. Those 25 stalls, all of them have unique concept that is related to movies. For example, there's a stall that is um, Avengers, uh, Avengers theme. There's this stall that's Grease theme. There's Fifty Shades uh, of Grey theme. There's Aladdin theme. There's Game of Thrones, Stranger Things. So it's really cool. Because we want the movie fanatics also to come here and then they go to the stalls and they see the themes and they'll be amazed by it. The thing with food parks is the tenants can afford to price their food offerings very reasonably because there are no added overhead costs. The price range roughly is about uh, 80 to 200 pesos. So when you come here, you can bring around 200 pesos and you'll be sure to be full when you get out. They opened only in November, so the Yard Street Food Cinema is still a work in progress. They will soon add more small but interesting details to reinforce their outdoor theme like twinkling lights that give you a sense of dining under the sky. Anna Barbara is particularly proud of their new thirst quenchers, which their experienced bartenders prepared with a lot of flair on the spot. And these drinks are really interactive. So since its theme is Avengers, uh, the drink you have to wear costumes before you drink it. Check out the Hawk Smash made with green apple and vodka.
another other bestseller, Iron Man made of white rum and mint. And this one, a real stress buster. Before we drink this, is we have to uh, use the hammer of Thor and smash this balloon so that you can release the stress. Actually, this is a complete costume with helmet and cape. So it releases the flavor after you smash the balloon. Now it's time to check out their hot dishes. This dish is really special, very affordable at 295. It's um, baby back ribs with three cheese that's melted with this torch and sweet corn. So it has goat cheese, mozzarella, cheddar, and cheddar. If you like bulalo like many others do, check out their carbonara bulalo pasta with loads of mushrooms. And this is their other best seller, which is called the Kofta Ball Pasta. So it has meatballs with mozzarella inside. And check out this pasta that comes in a cone perfect for takeout and so easy to go around with. It comes in a white sauce with a whole egg and bits of bacon. This is the specialty of Pipa. So they serve uh, what you call fried pizza. So I love this one because it's really crispy. It's called Lily Collins Pizza. And it's really affordable. It's only 270 and you can share it with your family and friends. And this next dish is a big serving that can be shared. So this is the barbecue and giant squid from Pitmaster Grill. So this is really good with beer and cocktails from Quencher. And lastly, before we go to the dessert, check out this crispy treat. This is from Crazy Sushi, which is uh, called uh, Crispy Ramen. So it's very Instagrammable. And it's the first here in the Philippines. It's crispy noodles with sausage inside. It's actually crispy noodles with a nice sausage inside. Now let's check out their desserts. This one is called the Chimney Donut Cone made with soft serve ice cream with gold nuggets and something that all kids love, Oreos. I would like to invite everyone to come visit us here at the yard. It's located here in Timog, in front of Laugh Line, so it's very accessible. And please uh, like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram.